If you get a job at Wendy's, what exactly will the home of the square patty expect from you? What are the most unusual rules? Keep watching for some of the weird rules Wendy's employees have to follow. At Wendy's, phones and photography are strictly prohibited for employees. According to the chain's rules of conduct, taking pictures, bringing cameras or other photographic equipment into Wendy's is prohibited unless written approval is obtained from the home office. Hoping to start a TikTok account exposing Wendy's or showing what your co-workers do behind the scenes? Well, it's off limits and you might lose your job. Wendy's is serious about this rule too, particularly the use of phones, noting in their employee manual that phones are not to be used where customers can see. Maybe that's because some things are better unseen. In a Reddit thread from a Wendy's staffer inviting questions about the chain, a user commented about Wendy's use of cheese and the procedure their employees have to follow concerning the dairy product. The comment reads, We leave our American cheese out for like an hour before use and it sits out even longer if we're slow. It's called tempered cheese. While this may sound disgusting, another user commented, In all fairness, the idea of tempered cheese might not seem appealing, but Wendy's did get special permission from the FDA to do so, so it's safe. We're not certain whether that last claim is true, but we do know we're guilty of doing the same thing at home every now and again, so we really can't judge too much. On another Reddit thread, one user mentioned more of the cheese practices at Wendy's, in particular, what they do to their cheese sauce. According to their comment, customers are basically eating melted cheese with hot water. Suddenly, we're not craving a baked potato anymore. If you are a fan of Wendy's chili and don't want anything to ruin it for you, beware. This rule that Wendy's staff has to follow might turn you off from their version of the famous soup. Wendy's employees follow a very specific and kind of disgusting protocol that multiple former employees on Reddit have admitted to. One particular user wrote that employees are to collect hamburger patties as the day goes on and later put them in the chili. A Reddit user said, They'll run them under hot water for a good while and then chop it thoroughly by mashing it with two spatulas. According to this user, the chili is assembled on site, but each different component is made separately. Most of us would expect staff to have to wear gloves for safety and sanitary purposes, but at Wendy's, sometimes the opposite is the case. That's right, Wendy's employees are forced to do certain parts of their job without gloves. On a Reddit thread started by a Wendy's employee, one user noted that employees are not allowed to wear gloves when handling meat of any kind. This user and another who commented on the thread found the policy kind of odd, and we did at first too. But there is a bit of an explanation. Another user pointed out that many restaurants follow this policy, claiming it's cleaner for employees to wash their hands thoroughly before, between and after each handling of raw meat, rather than using gloves and potentially cross-contaminating. Although this policy seems strange, it's actually keeping the food safer and encourages employees to be more hygienic. Not many jobs offer discounted food as a perk, but at fast food restaurants, it's standard. Wendy's offers employees a generous discount, but only at certain times. The employee manual states, Wendy's meal program allows a 50% discount for meals eaten half an hour before or half an hour after your shift or while you're on break. The maximum retail value is $10 per meal. Outside of those designated hours, staff are allotted a 10% discount and are unable to apply said discount to their family and friends' food. A Reddit user detailed this rule, adding that the chain also offers something called a VIP card that gives you a 25% discount. The user noted that these are only given to crew with certain requirements, suggesting perhaps one criterion to attain such a card is having children, but the user is unsure. Either way, Wendy's employees are certainly getting a good deal when it comes to the price they pay for their food. Hopefully, they don't get sick of it. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more mashed videos about your favorite fast food chains are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.